Okay, we're going to play this for a little bit. <clears throat> Because if that's who I think it is. There's two more characters. It is! Okay. But I don't know how to get them. Kindly. Uh huh. Hi. <laughs> Hi. We'll talk more soon. Hello. Woo! Woo huh? Whoa! <laughs> Holy Jesus! It's running out of money already. Hello. stuff I can sell. Yeah. We'll be back. What is that? Glass jar? <clears throat> Hello. Bye bye now. Huh? Ah, <gasps> that's pretty holy. No. Oh. Thank you that's kindly. Benton? Uh huh. Woohoo! 
I'll have to come back. Uh huh. <laughs> Hello. God damn. Thank you kindly. I have so many amazing neighbors. God damn it. Oh, why did it do that? I wonder if it's a realm or if it's like the one with Stitch and, um, Penelope. Or vanilla key.
Good to see you. You're okay. What's the matter, baby? Come in. You're okay. Like my dear Papa says, a drizzle will lead to a... Oh, greetings, neighbor. Hi. Bye-bye now. Uh-huh. I really hope it's another round because I have way too much dream light. It's been a while since we've gotten our new realm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm! It's a new realm. Well, hello. That's exciting. <laughs> I couldn't have done better myself. Nice. Oh, it's so pretty. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's this? A page with <clears throat> a page with neat cursive writing. It looks like someone is writing a story. The woman and the man of stone. Once upon a time, a young woman was walking in the woods. She heard a voice singing so sadly that it pierced her heart. She left the path to follow it. Okay. Oh, there's so much to explore. Holy crap.
very pretty in here. Page with neat cursive writing. It looks like someone is writing a story. You can speak, the young, wo the young woman asked, drawing closer to the man of stone, hesitating as she reached out her hand. Can you move? Not gonna lie, I'm gonna try my best, but my throat is very sore from coughing. So. Follow the flying book. I will. Right after I look at this. <coughs> oh my god. It's adorable. Oh, there's more. A voice led the young woman to a man of stone imprisoned in vines and thorns. He boomed at her as she approached to go away. It's so pretty. I can go out here? Holy cow, this is massive. In the young woman's village, no one believed the story about the man of stone, even when she showed her thorn wounds, they scoffed. I'm probably getting all sorts of backwards. The exhausted young woman fell asleep in her home with the thorn wounds burning. When she woke, she was transformed. When the man of stone saw the beastly young woman, he wept. He had tried to warn her about the thorns, but she howled with delight, slashing the thorns until he was free. Okay, that's something we need to come back to. When the man of stone saw the beastly young woman, he wept. He had tried to warn her about the thorns. Okay, did I just go in a circle? <coughs> or is that in here twice? The man of stone and the young woman headed deeper into the woods. They were truly free and chased adventure together ever, ever after the end. Okay. Very confusing. One spot I didn't check was over here. Looks like there's not really anything over here. So I guess back to following the book. Belle, what's going on here? Why are there books flying everywhere? Oh. oh, I... Do I know you? Mm. One for a quieter moment, I think. <clears throat> I'm afraid this sort of flying books is being quite difficult. <laughs> you enjoy wordplay oh. too? Well, I'd love to discuss it with you later, but for now... Will you help me catch them? Uh -huh. Once we collect all the flying books, I can explain everything. Goodbye.
Bonjour. You caught some of the books, and look, the rest of them are falling. Oh. Thank you for helping me stop the bookstorm. Mm. Old friend, it's strange. I do feel as though we've met before. The truth is hard to explain and harder to believe. For now, just trust that I am here to help you figure things out. Uh. Dreamlight Valley. It's a magical place filled with wonder and adventure and friendship. That sounds oh. like somewhere from one of my favorite books. It's just like that. You should visit once we sort everything out here. Uh huh. I'm not sure. The Beast and I had a disagreement. He asked me not to go in the West Wing again, but there was something there I wanted to see. I don't know that it did. I think it must have been something else. What happened next? We argued, then I left and came here to find something to read, but as soon as I opened my book, oh. all the books started flying off the shelves in a storm. I don't think it's part of the enchantment on the castle. It must be dreamlight magic. The storm of books was reflecting your feelings. Mm. Dreamlight magic. I've never heard of that, but the beast was the one who was most upset. He's locked himself in the west wing and he won't open the door for anyone. I've tried that. He won't answer me. Then I'll try talking to him. I don't think he'll let you into the room. Is there any other way into the West Wing? Mm -hmm. Well, when I first arrived at the castle, Lumiere did say something about a secret passage in the oh. library. I've never found it, but you could search the library and see if you can. I'm going to put these books back on their shelves. <coughs> I'm so excited. I'm oh. glad. Please come find me if you locate the secret passage in the library. Oh. You might want to check by the rolling ladder in the corner. I felt a cold draft there the other day. Oh, this is wonderful. found the secret passage that's wonderful it is intriguing oh. isn't it <coughs> like something out of a mystery let's go see the beast oh i think i ought to stay here he's still upset with uh -huh. me oh but you are a stranger he won't like a stranger in his room either even the staff really go in there. That way he might just think I'm a staff member. It is rather dark uh -huh. in there. I suppose it might work. I used to sew quite often when my father needed things for his inventions. With a few special items, I'm sure I can make a costume mm. for you. Let's see. We'll need castle candles, castle candle holders, and golden curtain. If you search mm. the castle, I know you'll find what we need for the disguise. I hope we can talk again soon. The young woman tried in vain to free the man of stone, to free the man of stone, but she wounded herself on the thorns and vowed to return with help. <coughs> I'm struggling today.
Did I miss this? I can speak the mana stone said, and I would be able to move if not for these cursed thorns. Hmm. the bell. Yep. Bonjour. You found everything for your disguise. Let me see what I can do. A stitch here, a button there. It's ready. Here, put this candlestick disguise and take the secret passage to check on the mm. Don't worry, I'm sure it'll be safe. He might seem intimidating, but there's more to him than meets the eye. Then follow my orders, leave me alone. I'm here to check on you. Your fluffiness. I'm fine. I told you all to leave me be, and I... Wait, I don't know you. Who are you? How did you get in here? Well, I, uh... Why are you dressed like a candlestick? 
You look ridiculous. Ugh. Now leave. I should throw you in the tower for trespassing. Wait, wait. I'm a friend of Belle's. She asked me to check on you, but it seems like you're a little busy fixating on that old portrait. Belle's sorry, and she's very worried about you. She is? She said that? Hmm. Okay, I'm guessing that hmm means... Hmm. And that hmm means I'm right. Are you feeling shame? What would you know about it? I know that sharing what you're ashamed of can make it feel less scary. She just deep inhaled. <laughs> she came here after I asked her not to, and she was just staring at it. The old portrait? Yes. She was looking at the face with so much... Ugh. How could I ever compete with myself? <laughs> no. Leave me. Get out. Farewell. <coughs> can I get out this way now? Is it a chest? No, I have to go back this way. Ah. You saw the beast? Is he alright? He thinks he'll never measure up to the prince in that old portrait you were staring at. Oh no. I was just trying oh. to see if there was something there that would help me understand who he was so I can better understand who he is now. Uh. I'm so sorry about that, Sai. I'm not sure what to do. What if you made him a new painting? What an interesting idea, oh. but I don't paint, do you? Mm. <coughs> well, I'm sure you have many other talents. If only we could snap our fingers and have a new painting. Hey, great idea. Maybe I can use some of my dreamlight magic to help us. I'll head to the valley and consult with Merlin. Oh. Who's a Mer what's a Merlin? Our resident wizard. Probably very tired at this point. Facts. You mean a wizard? You mean a real wizard like a storybook? Yep. Exactly. He's like a magical encyclopedia with a great hat. Merlin's always trying to help people in the valley with his magic and his experiments. Oh. Experiments? Hmm. <laughs> Merlin sounds... Shut the fuck up. Okay. Merlin sounds a bit like my father and his inventions. I'd love to meet him someday. Hey, maybe someday you will. For now, I'll go talk to Merlin about some magic to make a new painting. That would be wonderful. Whoa. I look forward to hearing about what you discover. Oh, this is wonderful. I'm not wearing this. Cheat. No, I have to go all the way to the beginning. <laughs> well, hello. Merlin, I visited Belle and the Beast in their realm and I need some help. It's a long story, but do you know of any enchantments that can make paintings? Oh. A creative quandary that, that certainly is fascinating. 
There are tools and charms that might just suit this purpose. They'll allow you to create an enchanted canvas, one that will paint itself. Why certainly? On occasion, I feel the need to rearrange and redecorate my study to reinvigorate my imagination with new stimuli. <clears throat> so I've used such canvases to preserve treasured moments and, as you might say, shake well. things up. Now, let's see. If I recall correctly, you'll need soft wood and fiber. Then you must gather white daisies, garnets, and dream shards. Oh, and there's one more vital ingredient. One you won't be able to find in the valley. <laughs> no, no, nothing like oh, that. As you, well... As you well know, Ash, the very best art comes from the heart. This is where our final spell comes from. Listen closely. Place. You must have Belle tell the canvas a story, ask her to share a happy memory of a time she had with the beast to activate the magic. When she does, you'll see a new masterpiece bloom right before your eyes. I tip my <coughs> eyes too, though I, I prefer not to take it off. <laughs> I don't think I have fiber. No, because I don't have seed. The daisies are easy because they're just down here, I think. I think this is where daisies are, actually. I'm not so certain. <laughs> Oh, well, Hakuna Matata. A yellow daisy. Are those daisies? There's one, two,
This place is so strange. Being brave doesn't mean looking for trouble. At least, that's what my father said. I can't run from my past forever. Give me just a second, I'll be right Sorry, I needed cough drops. <clears throat> That's rude. I'm gonna pause here for now because my mom is ready, so I'm gonna jump over to ESO for now. So I will be back. I swear, if it's Jack Skellington that comes out this Halloween, I'm so stoked. Look at this. Stop it. I will definitely spend the money to get all of that. <coughs> I'm not even going to lie. I'll be back shortly. <laughs> 